Hello. The video you are about to see contains images of dolls only. Hello everybody. Happy Tuesday. It is totally fantastic to be back on YouTube because thank goodness for large favours Rhea's feeling better. I'm so glad you're better, Rhea. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, we've really, really missed you. Hope you all had a wonderful Christmas and a happy new year to everybody. Um, Mr. B is out running errands, so I'm afraid you're stuck with me today. <laughs> so, here I have got my darling little Christmas baby. It is the Laura Lee Eagles Tobiah kit, and her name is Leona Christina. And you might have seen her on the Friday before Christmas, or you might have been too busy, in which case here she is. She's such a darling girl. Now, she has given me slight problems, and if you have a close look at her, you can see why. She is the longest, thinnest baby I have ever seen. And she is not my typical baby type. I buy chunky babies, shorter, chunkier babies. She is really atypical of the kind of baby I like. And I thought to myself, what can I do? Should I take her head off and chubby her up? But if you look at those legs, look how long and thin her legs are. Even the one that's bent uh, and this very long straight one. She has, you know, her legs really aren't chubby. They're beautifully shapely legs. And if I mess, I mean, she's precious baby. And Julie Clark knows what she's doing with, with wasting, with bodies, with stuffing. If I start messing about with this baby, it will be an absolute insult. But it's also completely unnecessary. If you look at her body, I'm just going to take your t-shirt up, darling. It's perfectly proportioned. Um, and I don't think it needs any more stuffing. If I overstuff it, it will get firm and hard. And it will be out of proportion to her legs and it doesn't need so I am having to get used to a very skinny malink baby and it's been a learning curve but it's been one I've enjoyed I did have problems with her at first but I'm getting over them now and I do love her she's such a little darling aren't you she's also such a little diva I call her my supermodel baby um what she wants she wants uh, what she doesn't want, she doesn't want, and she has really got a personality, a character, this little one. At the moment, because there's been a shift round in the nursery, let's get this over your head, uh -huh. it hasn't got poppers, has it? No, it's just a pulley pull. Um, she's sharing a room with Sam. Now Sam is, there you go darling, placid, he sleeps a lot. But if he wakes up and decides he wants something himself, then the sky can fall down, but he'll get it. So it's actually quite a battle of wills. Ugh, let's get these off you. Um, so it actually makes life very interesting at times, and that's putting it mildly. <laughs> now I'm going to change beautiful Leona into a very cute little dress and cardigan outfit. So we're going to take her socks off as well. Okay, let's get these little sockies off. She always gets the most lovely little socks, Jilly does. I can never find anything like this. They're just lovely and they always fit the babies. Now, the reason that We've been able to move rooms and find a bit more room for everybody at the moment. I won't say that it'll stay like that. It's because we have had to say two fond and very sad farewells. Um, I've been trying to thin down a little bit. Uh, can I give that to you and this t-shirt? Of course. Table. Thank you so much. And before I go on with that, let me show you what I'm going to wear. I forgot what colour this dress is. Oh, that's pretty. Um, it's white underneath, and we've got 
blue flowers, we've got violet flowers, we've got little green ones, and it looks like very like pinky brown, we've got all the leaves in different colours. And that's the white card. Yeah. Yeah. And then we have got some tights. The white ones? Yeah. So I'm going to put, go on putting her clothes on her while I tell you what's been going on. Yes, we've had to say two fond farewells. I've been trying to move on, rehome two of my girls that I really have not had the chance to bond with because as soon as they came, they had to go straight to a doll's hospital because in those far off days, I couldn't do reweighting and restuffing. If I could, they might have had a better chance, but unfortunately, I had such a bad time with the dolls hospital but by the time I got them back it was all messed up. So Melania has gone to America to begin a new life with Mommy Riley, Auntie Riley, that the other kids over here know very well because she's always leaving them wonderful comments. And she should arrive hopefully this Thursday we're hoping. Um now Christy was going to be going to Nicole, um, because she's been on eBay for like since halfway past forever. And I actually thought that her eBay had ended. I thought that it only had a month and then it would stop. That's what they originally told me. I did not realize she was still up there and I did not check. Um, and then last night, I suddenly got a notification to say, your eBay uh, your baby, Audrey Sturt, a baby girl, someone's made an offer on it. So before I uh, did anything, I talked to Nicole and I said, you know, what do you want me to do? You can still have the baby. And she said, no, I, I've got plenty of babies. If you can send her, oh, here's Mr. Beacon back. If you can send her to somebody and also make some money back on what you paid for her. I'd rather you did that. So that's where she's going. She's going to a new mummy. And thank you so much to Nicole for offering to give Christy a home and also for being so understanding when it, it you know, it didn't happen. So there's the tights on. So Mr. B has just been and Hi Mr. B. Hello. And Christy is on her way to her new mummy. I don't think she's YouTube. I don't recognise the name. There we go. But then, I don't know everybody who has a YouTube channel, so maybe not, maybe. There we go. Let's get this. I can't wait to see what she looks like in this beautiful dress. So I hope you all had wonderful Christmases. Ours was incredibly busy as it always is because we had so much to do on the radio um which is good because sometimes you know when there's only the two of you and there's no family um members to see over christmas and there's no no one that comes to you know see you and no one that you have to see it can get kind of lonesome um you see lots of oh darling careful of that head of yours you see lots of families celebrating together at Christmas and it can kind of feel kind of lonesome when there's just you two. So we always throw ourselves into lots of activities for other people and make ourselves busy. And of course we had opened all the presents with the kids on Christmas morning with Jack and Lacey and you heard that magic memories. And on Friday we will show you, touch wood, all their presents and we'll have them with us and they'll show you all their things. But they did get some cute things which we will be using on Magic Memories and videos. And in fact, on Sunday, you did hear Magic Memories where they were playing with Jack's new Doctor set, which was very cool. That, oh, I do love this dress. It looks absolutely delicious on you, Lily. Oh. oh, you are so long. Babies should not be supermodels. They really shouldn't. <laughs> My word, look at that, it's just so adorable. Lean forward, my precious, careful of your hair. Mummy has to button you up. And then I 
did not have time for any videos over Christmas because I was rushing about doing things. And then when I wasn't rushing about, I was relaxing and watching old TV dramas with, oh, careful of your head, sweet girl. I was rushing about and watching old TV dramas with Mr. B, which is what we really like to do in our downtime. buttons are tiny and very stiff. Uh, there we go. They're all done. There we go. What an adorable girl. The dress is really a bit too short for her. I think it's um, too small for her, to be honest. It's very pretty. That looks like a newborn sized dress. Um, but, um, I've, last weekend I had a really big, big, big catch up and I really enjoyed seeing all your videos. I had the most humongous catch up. I so enjoyed seeing your Christmas babies and your Christmases with your families. It was just wonderful. There she is. Oh, doesn't she look gorgeous? That is really, really sweet on her. It really is. Yeah. She really is a fashionista. She's my supermodel baby. <laughs> right, let's find her uh, boots. These will go, won't they? Yeah, they'll be fine. A little bit of pink never hurts. Well, that's pink. I think, isn't there pink in the dress? The uh, pinky brown, yeah. Yeah. So I think it'll turn all right. Otherwise, I haven't got any other shoes to put on. If they don't look right, do tell me and I'll take them off again. <laughs> what, would, what do we think? I think they look all right. Yeah. Right. They look all right from where I'm sitting. <laughs> Mr. B, come over here and say hello to everybody a minute. Can, can I get in I've, there? Can yeah, I, you can. Can I get in there? Otherwise, everybody's going to know. There we go. Happy New Year, everybody. <laughs> Here's our Mr. B. There we are. Do you want to see and who have we got? Oh, it's Leona, is it's it? Leona. Right. Look, have a cuddle of us. Oh, there we are. So yeah, I just got back in time, you see. You did, you There did. we are. You were sending Christy away. Come cuddle up a bit closer to us. You were sending Christy away to her new home. Yes, I was. There we are. There she is. So put an arm around us all. And all we'll right then, bye. we'll see. So we will see you tomorrow. Uh, is it tomorrow? Yeah, Wednesday. Yes, I will be here. So yeah. we will see you tomorrow. And we don't know what we're going to do. We'll just wing it. Okay. <laughs> so in the meantime, we'll love you and leave you. So take good care of yourselves. And enjoy your newly dressed babies. <laughs> and, and let's, let's be, be good, good to each other. Bye-bye.